What are we doing at night, Z? I guess it's the same thing we've been doing for 300 nights. It's Just right. not on a Friday. Maybe not. I'm too drunk to know. Oh my God. That's right. It's Our Reviews Will Kill You, the party time podcast that brings you news, reviews, and all that good stuff and more. I am the man you may know as Ian. I am joined by Noob Noob. And Letch Beer. And Letch Beer. We made it. We've done it. Unfortunately. It's 300. I tried to quit. Horny episodes. He just wouldn't let me because I'm the talent. And he's mm-hmm. like, I just cannot in good conscience continue this show with my measly comedic Just chops. me doing it, carrying, the, yeah. lifting that weight. I'm the yeah. cowboy bebop to you. Your... You're lifting enough weight as it is, kiddo. So, mm. you know, I'm here. Uh-huh. Daddy's home. Okay. Crank and rankles. So... Oh We've got this beer is gonna make me fat. <laughs> you already are. What's what are the you carbs of this? All the carbs. Oh, this is a pint. This can't be good for the for the weight. <laughs> My lord. Uh, yes. Well, you couldn't join us on a regular Friday, so I am in Nashville. If any of you are watching right now, getting swasted it with a bunch of country hillbillies mm-hmm. and they're then getting probably, left behind you'll be one of the left as behind. we speak they are probably touching my horses uh-huh that's my penis <laughs> i don't think so i think hopefully we'll see so for today's episode we're gonna do we're gonna do a little bit of news and then we're gonna go in the wayback machine and we'll review our own episodes i guess and talk a little bit about how great i am yes and how and how great how great it was to provide you with this greatness. Yep. And how great, I may great. orc you white again. I great again. Great. <laughs> oh my god. Well, um, you have no idea what's on today's episode, I, do you? There's um I know Scott's on it. Not yeah. in person. Not in person. He's too busy flying a drone up his butt. <laughs> he's droning. But uh in theory, we're gonna mention Scott, our greatest co founder of our no, he was he, Do we consider him a co-founder? Yeah, no, yep, a producer, early producer. I was the idea guy. Mm-hmm. You were like, I have a studio, and I'm like, shit, I guess. Okay. Um, uh-huh. And then Scott, I gotta get in on this. Yeah. Uh huh. <laughs> like, I see a talent. I gotta latch on to. Mm-hmm. Like a lech. Ah, oh, see what latch I did there. Latch on like a lech. Lech. Is this? This is Polish, right? Correct. It's good. Do they it's only that sell this? In, beer. Do they only sell it in pints? They only sell it in like there's there's only one version of it. It's only available in Poland. We are not in Poland, so this is. Confusing. I had to fly out and go get it. Oh my god! Bring it back. Hit it in my suitcase. Just oh, for you. I am almost done because it is getting warm. Well, like my testicles. Shall we? We won't go to housekeeping because we're not housekeeping. Want- although there, we are going to give um, Ant Man away. I think you're going to give it away. I maybe. Am. If I when how am I gonna? I guess away? Friday. Whenever I'm this is going gonna on, be, I'm gonna be in the chat on Friday. Yeah, you just choose whoever's in the chat is like mm. here you go. I know there was a cool guy that liked carpenter ants. Hopefully he shows up. If he does, he's got a real good chance of winning. He does. Yeah, he, he really does. We appreciate a good uh, a good anting. Yeah, because well, that I wish there was more carpenter ants in Ant Man. That would have made it better. Well, it's in God's hands now. It so. is. We'll find out the results in the future or even right now. So our giveaway is, as you have given away so many things to so many people, what was your favorite giveaway? Um, shit. What? How? I, the I, Christmas I, ones have to be your favorite. Oh, now. that's right. The Christmas giveaways where I just spent money. No, what was the one where I got drunk and bought a bunch of codes for people? <laughs> I don't remember. Yeah, didn't I give uh, who was not not Drain Knuckles Knuckles mm-hmm. Knuckles? I feel like I was scammed on that one. Oh, uh, we didn't talk. We didn't. Even, well, we'll see. Maybe we'll talk about who our favorite guests were because we've had a handful of guests over the years too. People we've started their own shows. And yes, YouTube people that stardom. we have rocketed off to YouTube stardom. Files of movies. I wonder how he's doing. Honestly, I gotta hold on. Let's let's look him up. What you is do that? What well, is Bluey Files doing? <laughs> well, how about I move on? Oh my God! It's the first thing that shows. Oh, it's because I searched it. Okay. Yes, it remembers things. Holy shit! What's he up to? Fifty one thousand. Oh, you're going to cry. Well, remember he was cheating the code? He was. And then he uh, used to do the show with his girlfriend. Dear Lord. Probably left him. Yeah, she was way too white for him. 
Uh, what, what, what are we doing here? I don't know. He's doing pretty good for himself. What does he break down, though? Barry? Uh, Do you really want to break down Barry? I don't. Do you want to give oh the God, Little Mermaid he watched the a little review? Mermaid. Did you really want to see that? I didn't. No. All didn't. 32 MCU movies ranked? Holy shit. Yeah. I don't even think you said who this was. Oh, yeah. 500 card. views. Five, and then he's got 22,000 views. What? He There's What's like up? ones he knows how to cheat on and the other ones no one watches. Yeah. Well, whatever. He's doing, he's doing better than us. So one day we'll get there. We're working on it. We're working on it. How about we go? Shall we go to the news? We should. Or do you want to keep discussing people that we've rocketed into? Oh, what's mid-level movie country reviews? Mid-level country bumpkins? I don't bumpkins. feel like take him to, you know, whatever. He just he like goes thrifting. And what happens when they close all the Walmarts and Targets in his area? I don't know. Because he's been shoplifting all of those Probably. videos. Probably. And his wife is going to divorce him because he spent too much money. Mm-hmm. Or, you know, maybe he bought her and she doesn't have a say in the marriage. We're not sure. It's hard to say. It's the South. It's, it gets crazy. Our, there. Our, we're, what about our favorite Sensibly Cynical? We can mention Oh, my God. We do like Sensibly Cynical. We what have kept one friend. We did. And he gave me a shirt and I wore it last episode. It was nice. It fits well. I like the orange. It's a quality it, shirt. It accentuates the, the chesticles for me. It hides the uh, gunt. You have like a rat tail on the back of your head, so I don't know what you're talking. Like, <laughs> I'd rather have a gun than first of all, I don't have a gun. Need a mullet? Yes, yeah. you have a gun. We you, filmed it, remember? Yep. Yeah, it was a bad angle for me. I don't know about that. Like, you need to show off to the people. Like, what what is going on with your hair? Like, <laughs> yeah, not all of us can have hair the, like a lesbian. That's the first thing I saw. I was like, was that you looked what like a lesbian? What went wrong in uh -huh. this last week to choose this type uh -huh. of haircut? <laughs> Um, so who else would you like to talk about? Uh, who el who else have we had on? Aussie Doc? bartender. Doc has not been on because he's a bitch. Um, Aussie, Aussie bartender. bartender's cool. I don't know if he's made a new drink in like a year or so, but you know we liked him while while he was making drinks. While he was making drinks, he's he still stopped. he's a cool dude. Mm -hmm. Maybe he's listening. I don't know. We love you from Australia. Hopefully, there's no more kangaroos burning down or you know that weird. koalas burning down. That was sad. I didn't, I didn't fire like koalas. Yeah, fire, fire Wallace. bears. <laughs> fire Wallace. All right. Well, let's shall we move on to the news? I guess so. I guess we could we could thank our lovely chat as well. We all could all the members of our chat Daniel. that have been there. Our admins. Who Ron are Cole, all of our Killer. admins? Yeah, Ron's an Doc admin. Doc is an admin. Daniel's an admin. Insult Insult Investor is an finally admin. an admin. Finally an admin. I'm an admin. Uh, we have new challenger Mokomochi. I'm trying to think of some other names that are out there. Drain, Drain yeah. Knuckles, uh, where's Big Man? Murphy. Doing your girlfriend. Probably. Well, I wonder if Big Man's gonna comment on the uh the three hundred episode. He should. On doing your girlfriend? Yeah. I better tell him. He should comment on that. He's like a genie. I just summon him and he shows up. <laughs> he's a genie. He must be homeless or something. I don't know. Like, he's not doing anything. He's Kai the homeless uh yeah. Yes, he's the most famous person we've had. All right, let's move on to the news. The news. Oh Very God. brief news that what, we're going to go through. What even is the news? Half-Baked 2 is the news. With Dave Chappelle? Are you kidding me? Yeah, right. Uh, so when did this come out? Like 20 years ago? A lot. The 1998? A lot of years ago. What, the long-awaited sequel to the 1998? No, I don't know about that. I don't think anyone's been Half waiting Bake for this. Was a good movie, though. Yes, it was, but and it's only good if you're if you're high. This is going to be called Half Baked Totally High. Oh God! It'll be R for who could possibly? So Dave Chappelle, Jim Brewer starred in the original. There's no way this. Any, who's going to want to watch this? So Dave Chappelle's not in this. No. Dave Brewer or Jim, whoever the other Jim white Brewer. dude. You don't know who Jim Brewer is. Is he famous? Yes. Really? He's a famous comedian. He was on SNL. Uh, he's, he's, pr he's pretty famous. What else has he done? Harlan Williams was in it. He was pretty good. I don't know who that is. Okay. Well, you don't know any. Guillermo del Toro? Not Guillermo del no, Toro. No, Guillermo Diaz. Is that... That's the guy in the picture? That's this guy, yes. Okay. <laughs> yes. Don't know who that is either. Wrap it up, B. Wrap it up. You've you never seen no from this the movie. movie yes but I don't know I don't know that he's famous I don't know that oh, he's still okay. doing stuff 
So I, I don't even know who's starring in it. Like, it doesn't seem like there's any point to this at all. So they so. announced it, but they didn't announce the stars. Correct. Makes a lot of sense. Yeah. Although, wait, hold on. Maybe they did announce some people. Directed by some dude who did six, <laughs> Sex Tuplets, a, ha- a Haunted House. I do like Sex Tuplets. Uh-huh. Uh, totally High is set to star the Maze Runner actor Dexter Darden. Sure. And then Moses Storm from Arrested Development and Unfriended is Miles. Ramona Young is never... I don't know who any of these people are. Nope. This is going to be a straight-to-DVD release. Is there even straight-to-DVD anymore? Straight-to-streaming. Paramount Plus. Straight-to-streaming. Or Max. It's now officially Max. It's it's a Max. That's right. It is Max. Gonna get maxed up. Um, So not super interested in that. No. Why would I give a shit about a movie that doesn't have Dave Chappelle? Are you interested in Johnny Depp and his disgusting, rotten Why teeth? Why are people now... I don't know if his teeth have really changed recently. I mean, he's a pirate. He's supposed to have rotten teeth, is he not? Fair enough. But he's... And he's 59. And I think he smokes Only four like a, years older than you. He smokes like a fucking chimney. So, you know, obviously there's going to be some teeth issues. Um, does he? Yeah, I guess he does smoke like a chimney. He does. And... Yeah, like I thought, I thought everyone loved Johnny Depp. Why are you attacking the man's teeth? Like I don't understand. Because he showed up to Con Film Festival, and all everyone did was bitch. No, what do you mean? I thought that he got like a seven minutes standing ovation. I'm just saying the pup, not the, not the people who went there. Is but that? The, oh my god, is that a picture of his teeth? Yes, those are his teeth. What? Well, did he just eat a plum or something? A plum. Like uh, some beets? No, he's a uh, he's a he's a doc uh, he's a no, a doctor. He's a uh, pirate. Uh, yeah, that doesn't look that that doesn't look right. Like there's some not okay there. Why do I have to see close up pics of Johnny Depp's teeth against my will? I mean, these are just people on the, you know, these are just internet people. bullies. He's been a tobacco smoker his entire adult life. Okay, so, yeah. there it doesn't look terrible. He did get a standing ovation at Khan. For what? I don't know. What was he even in? I think just being there. there. He was. He got no ovation for being there. Interesting. Yeah. Maybe he's going to be in uh, Pirates of the Caribbean 7 or whatever it is. Yeah. I mean, he's pretty rich. You'd think he could get them fixed. If he wanted to. But he doesn't have to. He's Johnny Depp. He can do whatever he wants. Right? I still do him. Right. But I still do him. He has wears he, eyeliner, though, so that's a little weird. At the age of 59. Yeah. Has he degraded to uh, the level of Gollum? Uh, not yet. Gollum, Gollum. Hey, Johnny Depp Gollum, I think he's still pretty attractive. So who's more attractive, Gollum or Johnny Depp? Johnny Depp. Okay. But Johnny Depp as Gollum would be the most attractive. Were you excited for this uh, Gollum movie or video game? It's a game. And, yes, it's a game. Uh, no. <laughs> There's a one st- they have a this is uh Digital Trends gave it a I guess a one star review. It looks stupid as shit. I thought they said they weren't even going to review it because it couldn't even load properly. Yeah, it's there was a- seventy dollars. There's a is it really? Yes. There's a bunch of bugs I heard for it, and it's a, supposed to be a stealth game. But why would anyone want this? Like, whoa. I had no idea whose idea was this. I I watched uh, Moist Critical play the game, Charlie, and, and it looked great, did it? No, he was doing it because he was like, "I'm gonna speed run this," and he's like, "I have to play this garbage game. I have to get to the end." And it's so funny whenever Gollum dies, it's like a terrible platformer where like you don't know where you're gonna grab onto, like you just kind of hope and pray. And anytime you fall off the edge, like it just says you are dead, and there's no noise. Oh my god! Like it doesn't do anything. It's just you like you dead. died. You are dead. Yeah, it's really and like who would sympathize? Like, why would you want to help Gollum get out of anything? Also, what is got like what is his power? Like, what does he do? He's trying to. It's in the time in between. Um, when he when he meets Sam and Frodo, or no, when he loses the ring for the first time. Yeah, when he loses the ring and before he meets Sam and Frodo, he like gets tortured in a pr- in a prison or something. Basically, it's a bunch of like fetch quests and then occasional stealth, but it's not really very stealthy because people showed you could just like jump in the middle of a bunch of AI and just fall down and, and just beat it. So, and it's super like glitchy, like it, 
it goes like like slows down a lot yeah it's pretty terrible so i'm gonna buy this and me and the boys are gonna play it next weekend sounds like i mean if you want to you know roll around with a scrawny uh white dude that sounds like a I mean, thing. Not a bad idea. With a hobbit. Not a bad idea. Former spoiler, he used to be a hobbit. Does he go and just is the end boss Frodo and the Sam the, the and final, just wrestling? And just no, sexual I don't think wrestling. So. I don't think so. Naked just sucking put, on each other's fingers. Naked pudding wrestling? No. My god, that'd be so hot. Hmm. I think this is the time where Daniel's probably spitting out a bunch of facts in the chat that we're none not aware of. Exactly like when it is in canon. The fact of Are you predicting? The main fact that I'm predicting is that he's like Z is a bitch, Noob Noob's the best. That's what I'm predicting. Yeah. He's saying I'm assuming he's just the just repeatedly typing, copy and paste mm-hmm. in this entire chat. Z's it sucks. Mm-hmm. So just like Gollum. Well, you know what else might suck? Not Gollum. How to train your dragon live action. Does this seem like a good idea to anyone? Depends on how hot they are. You're about to see. Uh, I'm, let's see how hot you think these children are, noob noob. This was a trap. <laughs> <laughs> you know this. You know that you've seen the movies, right? You could have aged them up. Oh, then right. You could have aged them up. <laughs> um. So the one kid, the black phone star, Mason Thames, Thames, Times, whatever, and Last of Us actress, Nico Parker, will star in Dean DeBlois live Wait, action. Wait, Last of Us? Who the hell was she in Last of Us? The, his daughter. Uh, Really? Yeah, I think so. I'm 90% sure. Mm, Google her real quick. You have a thing in front of you. God damn it. Google her. All right. Um... She doesn't exactly look like Ingrid to me. <laughs> or Ingrid? Who's the... Nico... Pa- oh, yeah, it is the 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 weird-looking one. She seemed like a good actress, but uh, isn't she supposed to be a Viking? It literally says right here. It says... Uh, it's focused Vikings. on a special friendship between a young, unheroic unhero- Viking named Hiccup. She doesn't look much like a Viking to me. I am confused. She's Astrid. Remember what Astrid looked like? White. <laughs> Blonde. Because they're chick. Vikings. Because they're Vikings. So con- I'm a little yeah. confused. I think uh, I think the, the black phone kid looks like a uh, a good hiccup, though. He looks like a decent hiccup. He's 15. Yeah. How good does he look to you? I think he is well endowed for 15. Uh-huh. Um, you know, it, just in the movie. I think he's legal in real life. It says he's 15. Oh, shit. Um, <laughs> well, what I would like to say... There's a, here's your Ingrid. Are you ale- ready for is, that? Is allegedly... Are um, you ready for this Ingrid? Wait, Astrid. Who, who, I'm sorry. Astrid, I keep yeah, saying I like, Ingrid. Yeah, yeah. I mean, it, what's the difference? Uh, uh-huh. Oh, <laughs> that looks like an Astrid to oh, me. Oh, shit. <laughs> I mean, she seemed okay in Last of Us, but let's see a picture. <laughs> They're going to show us, aren't they? I think people will be a little confused. No, there's just hook. No, they're toothless. like, we're just going to show the the other dude. I mean, tooth- who's going to play Toothless? I don't know who's going to play to- Jack Black. Hopefully. Or uh, Wesley Snipes. Sure. Wesley Snipes. He is about toothless. as dark as Toothless. So that makes okay. sense. Okay. Wow. And he flies away from paying taxes. <laughs> so. <laughs> wow. Just wow. Oh, there she is. Oh, <laughs> that is the whitest bitch ever. It's a little confusing. Astrid is, uh, yeah. If you're listening on the audio podcast, be sure to take a look and, uh, you can look up these actors yourselves or you can catch us on YouTube, Rumble, those good places and more. It's all good. What about, oh, okay. I guess we can move on from the news and we can get outrageous. Oh, what's an outrage? Totally, totally outrageous. Oh, outrage, my daddy. Okay. Well, the first one is, and this is specifically directed towards you, I think. Okay. First of all, you're definitely Georgian. Go on. Uh Uh-huh. Drivers are urged to stop taking nude license photos. Please wear clothes. How can you, can you do that? Apparently, on their digital identity cards, they're taking nude photos. I don't know how they do that. Attention, lovely people of the digital era. Please take pictures with your clothes on when submitting them for your digital driver's license and IDs. I guess it's so hard for people to get IDs in Georgia. 
you know, cause you need them for basically everything anyway, that they just choose not to wear clothes. There's even like signs and stuff now. I mean, it also makes sense. Wouldn't you want to identify someone in their purest form, like mm. penis and all? How are you going to refute that? They're like that. That shaft is six point seven inches, two inches of girth. Like, what? What are you packing? How? How are you refuting that as ID? Why? Why did they show us any examples? I don't know if that's legal. Why? If you put it on a public record, because you can be sixteen and have a driver's license. That's underage. That's porn. In Georgia. That is that is CP. It says the DDS clarified shirts are nice. We want shirts for selfies. I tried to take a naked picture from my ID, but it kept, but I was asked to leave the DMV. Okay. Yeah. So there's that. Do you feel outraged? I mean, or yes. If there are ugly people taking it, if there's hot people taking it. Do you think it? that there are hot people taking naked selfies? Isn't for, that every porn actress ever? Uh huh. Not everyone. There's a lot of ugly porn people, but still, some of them are hot, mm -hmm. and they take nudes. Well, all right then. What about, how do you feel about knife-wielding attackers? I like that they hopefully kill the people they're attacking. Oh, so you want them to kill Benedict Cumberbatch? I do not. No. Why would you want to kill Doctor Strange? Well, apparently a knife-wielding chef screaming for Benedict Cumberbatch while attacking the actor's home. I know you've moved here. I hope it burns down. The attacker screamed outside his London home. First of all, his first mistake was living in London. <laughs> Second mistake, he's he's lucky he lives in London because they are only allowed to wield knives. Right? It's like the town of machete attacks, and yeah. knife attacks, and acid attacks. Because you can't get guns. Yeah, but wouldn't throwing acid on somebody or stabbing them with a knife still be attempted murder? Yeah, but the police and the police don't have any guns. So. Yeah, but isn't the the punishment kind of the same though? It's like still. I don't know. Are you British? I don't know. Well, anyway, uh, this guy Jack Bassell, thirty five, admitted to criminal damage earlier this month and was fined the equivalent of three hundred and ten dollars by a judge, imposed a three year restraining order. I mean, that's that's definitely going to deter him from attacking these people again. His wife is Sophie Hunter, and they have three children. Oh, my God. He's got three kids? Yeah. Does he? Bissell reportedly kicked through an iron gate, ripped a plant from a garden, and threw it against the wall. Then he spat at the intercom and stabbed it with his fish knife. And that sounds like a regular day at the, jo at the job, right? They identified him with DNA through his saliva he left behind. So he's a spitter. Oh, my God. Yeah. <laughs> No wonder he's a quitter. You probably should move out of London. I'm just saying. What do you mean? Benedict Cumberbatch is rich enough. He probably is in the good part. In the good part of, of London? London? London's awesome. What about like, A, you've never been there. There's fish and chips and such. You know, it's it's just as bad as all the rest of the like world, like major cities, like full of homeless people and Isn't people it? with knives. Of course. I hear they got popping Indian food. They do. Well, all right. Well, that's all you need. Okay. Well, you can eat some eels too if you like. Eels? Mm hmm. Do they have that? For sure. It's like some famous, like, what is it? Hot eye in the pie in the hole or something? I don't it's know. An eel. I don't know. There's some eel dish. All right. They like eels. I would try it. Sure. We'd review it. Uh, how do you feel about going swimming? I like swims. Okay. How do you feel about being on one of those platforms in the middle of a lake? I feel less good about that. <laughs> well, a lurking alligator traps swimmers on a platform in the middle of a Texas lake. Video shows. Ooh, we might have video. It reminds me of that Stephen King short story, The Raft, that was on, uh, it was in Creepshow, I think. The the movie from that, the horror movie from the 80s. Yeah. Where those kids got trapped on the raft and like an, an oil slick was eating them. Never watched it. Don't know what you're talking about, but I know there was a thing called Creepshow. Okay, so, well, instead of an oil slick, they were trapped on by a alligator. Why didn't they just wrestle it? 
I was going to say strength in numbers. You have everybody jumping in to attack that alligator at once. Only one or two are going to die. Is it alligators are among creatures that live in the lake, which is in a northern suburb of Houston? Many people uh, said that visitors are often warned about the lake's inhabitants, but why would they have a platform you could swim out to if it wasn't safe? It's a little weird. Wouldn't you just assume? It's like they wanted people to get eaten by this alligator. Well, I don't have the video. I just have this picture of people. That alligator alligator. looks super rapey. (laughs) So you're just like, if there's 30 of you waiting on a platform, you're like, if we all go at the same time, he can only get one of us. Yeah. He would take it by force. What if he has friends? Uh, Well, you know, Godspeed. 30 him, 30 of you. It's in God's hands now. It is in God's hands. Well, that's all I have for outrageousness. Oh, my God. That's the that's the full outrage. What about... We don't have really any in and out, but we can review something. We can. We're going to take... Ourselves. A, yes, we're going to take a trip down memory lane, memory hole. We're going to go down the memory hole, pie hole, home hole. Yep. Hole hole. Dick hole. Review! Oh, the reviews that we reviewed. We're reviewing our reviews. So we'll try, we'll like just check out some of them. My God, that's the best review of them all. Look at that beard, that hat, that that's chest That's before hair. you turned full lesbian. Look at that chest it's hair. Before though. you transitioned. Mm. Delicious. So what video is this and why did you want to talk about Clearly, this? Clearly it should be, and it is in the hearts of our true fans, our most popular video and most watched time. Basically it should be the best of everything. Why, it's I, very why don't you disturbing. add a little thumbs up right there? Well, there's, there's only 17 of them. There we go. Um, it's not this, very many thumbs up. It's not a lot of them. But this is when we reviewed the greatest Netflix show of all time, Cuties. Oh, my God. Yeah. <laughs> Just leave it there. Ugh. Look at them rotting teeth. Look at me. Oh, that does kind of look like rotting, doesn't it? Yes, it does. Oh, my God. Look at you. Um, Disgusting. That's that's like Johnny Depp. I do a lot of tobacco. A lot and, of cocaine. Um, you know, I've had three teeth replacements since that point. Uh huh. So you feel God better about my it. my dentist. He did wonders. And um, yeah, th- this was where we really dug in. I went hardcore and went through all the juicy little ins and outs of, of cuties and, uh, you know, tried to tantalize everyone else to give it a shot and see what they liked. You, you, you would be surprised. Cuties. And, uh, we, should, we should make a cuties renaissance. If you all just go to this video. And play it for 24 hours straight. Uh huh. That is Have what's going to enter marathon. you into the next giveaway. <laughs> uh huh. So, 24 hours of cuties. Let me know. Record yourself recording cuties for 24 hours. And then that's an automatic win. Yes. It is a disturbing, uncomfortable review. I will buy you an cuties. entire carton of them. Very disturbing. You won't know what to do with yourself. There's going to be two men to choose from. Yes. So. And. So you give this a 10 out of 10? Absolutely. Your favorite video. This was one of the good edits that Scott did. Yes, it is. Yeah. Yes, it is. With a little help. Well, obviously, I I helped him because I did it. Uh Uh-huh. Yeah. What were you doing, by the way? Uh Uh-huh. Yeah, that's what I thought. Right. Nothing. (sighs) Nothing. Then we have uh, one of our videos that got us into trouble, I guess. Is this one of our least liked? Uh, no, I think it's somewhere in the middle. Well, we just angered people because we went against red letter media and people love them. Yes, we went against God's will, apparently. Yeah, 55 comments on this one. Yeah. There's a lot of controversy. All we were trying to say is that red letter media and pitch meeting had different takes on it, and we didn't really go negatively against it. That is it. true. Wasn't everyone misreading what we were doing yes they just assumed that we were insulting red letter media and i don't think that we were although they did like that stupid movie so they are God, that stupid movie's for that. free on amazon prime right now and you couldn't give it away no I, I didn't buy it i did not buy it it's fucking garbage oh my god you didn't buy it no and i own all the other halloween oh so my that's god like, that's a commitment for me not to buy that movie but it very was much so so shitty and so filled with woke bullshit that I could not, in good conscience, spend my shekels on it. You could not. My hard-earned red-pilled shekels. Right. Yeah. So, yeah, it was a pretty pretty bad... I didn't watch it. One of our top videos. Yeah, it really, did okay. We really rocketed up our We didn't really time. talk about... Uh, 
Liver King, but this is another 10 out of 10 video. Yeah, I, I don't know why Liver King did so well for us. It's kind of weird. Like, Liver King isn't isn't that popular, is he? He's not anymore. <laughs> did he get canceled? Oh, I mean, he had to admit that he wasn't natty. Ah. So Liver King was that guy who was super jacked up, who was eating all the livers. At 50 years old And said that he was all natural, all natty. Which is impossible it at was, 50. Yeah, and everyone called was. him out on it, and then basically... More plates, more dates. Called him out. And was like, dude, you you tried to contact me on what your what your steroid like regimen should be. <laughs> like, didn't uh, didn't Joe Rogan call him out? Well, Rogan was like, there's no way that guy's not. He's like, he's more jacked than me, and I'm on steroids. <laughs> yes, exactly. He's like, I'm on all every, all, every Mexican supplement. Joe Rogan. On the planet. As soon as what what is it? Uh, what do you when he hit 40, forty? You get TRT. You sure can. Yeah, Joe Rogan was waiting for. It. He's like, oh, when am I aging to forty? I need those pumps. Mm, get them greens. Yeah. Yeah. He's trying to be Harry Spotter. My God. Is that next? No. No. We're no. going to talk about a little incident that got us into some trouble. I almost got murdered. Yes. Got us some death threats. Because I insulted this dumb fucking whore <laughs> from this stupid Gotti family. Yeah. Way to go after one of the, one of the, what the New York what crime the families. What the crime families ever? Yeah. Who's got who's the Gotti one that even? can't even be troubled to actually kill who, you? Who is who's like the, what's the name Gotti? Like Gotti, like what is it? Something Gotti. Like what's the name? John Gotti. Is it John Gotti? I think so. And he was what a uh, forget about like a, like it. A trash can guy or something. He, a trash panda. Yeah. Were like, these like the trash who, panda days? You don't uh, probably. It. Um, he was a member of the Gambino crime family. Was it? So he wasn't even his own crime family. No, because it's about John Gotti. It's not about it's. He was the head of the Gambino crime family. Think of it like. Wouldn't it be the Gotti crime family? No, who was the head because of it? you it, it's connected back to the old Italian crime families that first established the original mafia. Yeah, it seems stupid. It's like a brand name. You have to have a brand name, like Gambino. I, I guess. And then you can't just establish a new brand name. It's like yeah, Target. Who, who's the better one uh, from Chicago? We're talking about Al Capone. There we go. Capone. Okay. Well, Cap there is no Capone family. There might be a Caprizi family. Yeah, but not. wasn't Capone the leader of something? Yeah, but that doesn't... It's still a crime family. And you have to have the family name of like Gambino. Yeah. Childish Gambino. Oh, my God. Is that where you got it from? Just, uh, yeah. Is it really? Uh-huh. What? Oh, my gosh. So you're still alive, unfortunately, for everybody. Yeah, they didn't. They, what, what was the daughter's name? Leah Gotti? Leah Gotti? She's a bitch. <laughs> Two-piece hack. Probably too fat. She was mad she's... that you reviewed a movie you never even watched. Uh, yeah. It it's... doesn't even have a review anymore. It, it was at 0%. Now it's at nothing. <laughs> the audience score is 44. Honestly, not terrible. I've seen worse. I have seen worse. Yeah. Fucking stupid-ass crime family. If you're going to be a crime family, fucking take some action, pussies. Mm-hmm. Yeah. We On beat a crime move. family. Just saying. All right. Well, Scott was the main culprit, though. <laughs> 10 out of 10. Snowpiercer. Our greatest short ever. Is it, though? It is. The world engine where we literally just report that it was canceled. But nobody believes us. They're all like, this they, can't be possible. And to this day, what is it? March, May, March, Jesus Christ. May 31st, 2023, although when this airs, it's still going to be true. June 1st, 2nd? June 2nd, 2023, Snowpiercer is still fucking canceled. <laughs> I think the problem is, is in other countries, it's, it's on Netflix. So everybody's like, why doesn't Netflix just pick it up? And Netflix doesn't own it. TNT owns it. So if TNT wants to sell it, they will. But I think they might just write it off and take the loss. Yeah. Because people were saying, what, the fourth season's already filmed? Something yeah, that, like that? That's what was weird. Everyone was like, the fourth season was already made. They're airing it and blah, 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 blah. They and, ain't airing it. And I, I want to say if that was true, when did we make this video? Like four months ago, five months ago? Mm-hmm. And uh, it, still no news. There, there would have been some kind of update. You would. We think. will do a follow up if it gets uncanceled. Absolutely, though. or we will just continue to say it's canceled. I'll do a Snowpiercer canceled sequel where it's still canceled. <laughs> you could do a Snowpiercer 
uh, sequel. That, that would be a dick move. Breaking news, everybody! Breaking news! Snowpiercer still canceled. Still not picked up. That and everyone who help. says it is is dumb. Oh my god! Yeah, good. I mean, I want. I wanted the fourth season. I'm not going to disagree with wanting another season, but wasn't that good of a show to be honest so I, you know i did not think it was a very it good is show. what it is i tried watching and i was like this is not as good as the movie it's all right with captain america Ooh, captain america was in the uh the movie yeah much different ending though much different what yeah. is this why is this playing uh in our, our like number one video of all time for some reason fifteen thousand. One of the most hated reviews. shows ever. well that's probably why it's got so much in there's 107 comments on this G- great that wasn't even was that the what finale great review. episode 10 was it 10 episode, episode one of 10 what no no, no. oh episode one. Oh, this yes. is the first episode yeah so people were like all about remember we were like even doing hype up to the rings of power we like reviewed the trailer oh yeah we did yeah, and then yeah. we reviewed like those weird characters i forgot about that yeah. yeah you forgot it existed and now no one's gonna care that it existed because they're going to remake the actual Lord of the Rings. <laughs> so the Rings of Power is completely irrelevant at this point. And they spent like a billion dollars on and it. And I don't even think that's on... Uh, the, the remakes are not going to be on Amazon, right? No, someone else bought them. I don't remember who. I feel yeah, like, I forget. Yeah, we reported on it, but I don't remember who. Who knows? We need we need more House of the Dragon to come out to have good good shorts. They are filming it right now. Even with the writer's strike, they're still filming House of the Dragon. No, they're not. Wait, yes, are they, they are. One hundred percent. So they unstruck the the House of the Dragon writers. What do you mean? It's already written. They can film it. They don't uh, need the writers there to film it. Aren't writers on set for shit though? Not necessarily. Usually, the showrunner is on set, who's like in charge of the writers. That's weird. And sometimes the showrunner is a writer. Um, what was that? Some show, the showrunner walked off of. I forget which one. Not sure. But, yeah. Either way. What's this one? Something what about there? Hulu? Oh, uh, God. This is our most hated video. One of them. I, well, maybe we'll make the it unhated. Animaniacs. I don't know why people were so mad about this. I don't even think... I think it got, like, canceled anyway. Like, it never even made... Like, it made it to air. No one watched it. It got completely canceled. People were mad at us because we said it was going to be trash. The Animaniacs. Hulu presents Animaniacs. Who cares? Yeah, that was... That was a three-way. Uh, what what was that program that was stolen from us? Oh yeah, whatever that was. Uh, Streamlabs. Str- no, not Streamlabs. Yes, it's something by Streamlabs. Rendezvous. By Rendezvous. Streamlabs. Rendezvous. Yeah. Borrowed from us. Borrowed permanently. permanently. Yep. Good old scat. Where yep. you still running the show? Wasn't he the one who watched Animaniacs? Correct. Oh my god. I never watched it. I didn't even know where it was on. This is just a teaser for it. So it was like... Think of those 10-second reviews we could have had back then. If only you had had, had an idea. I know. I or is ha- this the most hated video? This could be the most hated video. Your Legend of Zelda. No, that's the short. The yeah, vi- but that's pretty much hated. The short's hated more than more the video? Than the, yes. Really? Yes. No shit. Yep. I got to play that eventually. <laughs> yeah, that would be a good... Watch, you're going to come back and be like, I love it. You need I, to do I a groveling it. apology. I, doubt that you I'm don't have love the it. attention span to play zelda no my god why you even bought it i don't know it was uh it was ten dollars off oh because you went to costco i did i love a good deal do you love a good deal i love a good deal for and a paperweight the here here's the secret costco is a grocery bill so my girlfriend bought the groceries that day and she pays for 65 percent of the groceries so she paid for most of zelda wow you guys i won some sort of weird i hacked uh, it son hacked it that's real strange so i paid for like 30 you guys are like down to the penny huh oh my god hey i'm a uh, i'm a i'm a numbers guy i like to keep (laughs) things on track i would say that you are a member of a certain tribe i am the tribe of getting my paper uh huh. Yeah. What about them pennies? I love the pe- hey, a good shiny penny will get you <laughs> the way you, you want to go. Love them shekels. Yeah. Would you? Uh huh. Well, that's that's very disturbing. It okay. is. And then I guess our our final one to review. What do we got? The the episode that, that it changed all, it all that changed it all. 
This is the oh, yeah. so for those of you. Do we ever explain why? Or no, 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 no. Oh wait, no. What was the idea that really? It was noob noob tries. That was our. That was the big idea. The big idea that was going to propel propel us into. Uh, yes. Into stardom. It was Scott's million dollar idea that, that he make you do work around his house. Yeah, he wanted me to be a white slave. Work. He wanted me to be an unpaid laborer at his house, trying things that I have no business doing and no. that I'd probably die trying. Yes. So I think it was his weird way of trying to kill me. Maybe. And I was reluctant to do so, obviously, because I like not dying. And yes. I, d- I don't think he took too kindly to that. He did not like that you would not enter into indent- indentured servitude for him. Yeah. And uh, episode 189. So we've done, so we did 190 we did a, without him. That was the first one, Mortal Kombat. So how many have we done? 110 110, without yeah. That's a so, lot of episodes. Yeah, but it's less than what we've done, what we did with him. Yeah, he is still the majority of our, not the majority, he's the greater half of our show so far. <laughs> I mean, he always was, he the was the He was the greater half always, yes. Always the greater half. He, he brought a lot to the table. Uh-huh. Um, so how, wait, hold on. How many do we need to do to surpass that? No, we got a lot more. To we go. got a long way to go before we have a new milestone. Yeah, we might as well just get to 400. No, no, no. Wait a second. Hold on a second here. No, You're, 180. Oh, 190. We so we got to do 80 more episodes. Yeah, we need 80 more episodes. So we'd okay. have to be at 380 for us to. Shit, no, that's a, there's only 52 weeks in the year. That's, that's another year and a half. Yes. God. See this? This is history here. Yeah. This is strange. Look at that. We sat next to each other. It was adorable. Oh, wait. We still sit next to each other. Uh, wait, we were all one camera back yes, then. Yes, we were oh, all one camera. That was so much cuter. I can't believe you, you have struggled with that. Yeah, so much cuter. Look. Oh, look. Oh, look it's at that. You. Yeah, Noob Noob says what? Because you're would, a dumpster fire. He would try to trap me into saying racist things. Yeah, you don't need a trap. Now you, you trap me into saying it. racist things. I, but I'm like, I'll beat you to it. <laughs> no, I'll say the racist things. I'm already the first one in line. Yeah. Yes, you are. Still wearing that noob noob hat though, my god. Yep, you that might was, need to retire it. That was a good one. Get a get something a little. Yeah, remember he would like zoom closer to your face. Yeah. Oh, when I went on my like diatribes and stuff like that. Yeah. I don't know if it was diatribes. I think he was just waiting for you to say something incredibly racist. Yeah. Insensitive. Wait, who were who were the people in the chat? Let's. Let, oh wait, who were Ray Sai, bootleg sampler. Oh yeah, bootleg. Well, what are happened to him? I think he we lost him in the divorce. Oh God! Was uh, any any D- Daniel? I don't think was there at that point. Oh, what happened to Ray? I don't know. Interesting. Maybe you you gypped him on a uh, on one of those. Yeah, uh, what do you yeah, call? Yeah, that's sad. Ray Ray used to be around for a while. Yeah. Damn. I think he uh, he got oh jeez, a little too much of the. He felt the the uncomfortable vibes. Of that episode. Did he? I think a lot of people... Didn't we rewatch it and we were like, this is uncomfortable? Like Scott really wanted to stab both of us with knives. Yeah, well, mostly you because you didn't want to be his indentured serve. That's servant. true. I like yeah. to be paid. At least minimum wage. Seven twenty five in PA is not terrible. That's what it is? Seven twenty five. I think so. That's pretty terrible. It's really bad. No one could survive on that. Please raise it. No. I think they should like lower 20- it. I think Oregon's like twenty dollars an hour. And how are they doing? They're not doing too great. Yeah, but still. Portland is doing great. San Francisco right? doing also not in Oregon, hey, but sure. They won a couple of NBA championships with the Warriors. And how's that working out for them? A couple of NBA championships. Uh huh. You know, none of their people live there. <clears throat> really? I don't know. I would assume they don't. You think they live in San Francisco? I mean, maybe. Would do they like to be attacked by homeless people? Yeah, but they're so rich. None of the people who play for Philadelphia live in Philadelphia. Uh, they live in like the outskirts. No, they live in New Jersey. Do they really? <laughs> yes. But Jersey sucks. It does. They pay a lot of taxes there. They do. It's strange. Fucking Jersey. It's weird. Piece of shit. Yeah, I don't know why they go there. It's I don't know. Bizarre. Um, I don't know. Is there anything else you'd like to reminisce about? I don't know. Where's he, didn't you have like a favorite giveaway or anything like that? What was? Oh, the Christmas giveaway. Oh yeah, those we are really cool. those are very cool. Yeah. Oh, you forgot to mention uh, 
Well, well, first I'll say I really do enjoy the Christmas spirit where we get to see everybody's trees. That's always a good time. I love seeing a good wood with some lights on Get it. you some wood with some balls. Yeah. Uh, you forgot Infinity. Oh, my God. Well, he forgot us. That is true. He does. So, he, he is also like 18 million hours ahead of us. He is. Too busy going to all these weird carnivals in his backyard. Carnivals. <laughs> filming people without permission. <laughs> Not getting permission. Driving his dead, putting dead them on, wire around. Putting them on YouTube I mean, without he's permission. my dream. That's that's what I want in my life. But driving his dad's jaguar. I'm in America and I have to work for a living. That's very sad. So, yeah, that was the the, the holiday giveaways are probably the best ones. I guess, I guess we we're also we had a one time sort of co host or guest host. Oh, you don't talk about her illegal? anymore. <laughs> talk about Jennifer Lopez. Jennifer Lopez. Jennifer Lopez. Jennifer Lopez. Yes. Yes. We yeah, had she, one. She came whole on episode. and got kidnapped. I think. Yes, I think Live something like that. Um, the, well, Were no, we no, filming we, at that point? I don't think so. No, it was just it was just voice. Yeah, that's the problem too, because we were looking at our least viewed videos, but there's like a whole bunch of them because we made the mistake of just putting up. We weren't filming anything. We weren't even doing YouTube really. Yeah. We we're just posting our audio podcast and just sticking like a static image up and people. I think somebody asked us to do it, and then we were like, I guess we could film it. I don't know. And then Scott, well, the no, filmmaker. We, we started out filming, and then we went away from it because it was a lot of editing effort for Scott. Ah, uh, yes. And then, well, that's because we were putting, like, he made it too complicated. Because yes. he was editing in all those pictures and, like, every reference we would make, he would put a picture. Like, good you know, good for him in terms of gumption, but who the hell's going to do that for an hour and a half episode every time? I'd want to kill myself. Without getting paid, correct? Yeah, not for free. Yes. You do nothing for free. No, why would I do that for free? No, anything. You do oh, literally nothing. I literally come here just for the alcohol. Uh, I'm gonna buy this myself. I'm poor. I don't know about that. Yeah, daddy money bags here. No, it's mama money bags. No, if it was mommy, mommy, mommy money bags, why are you still? Why are you paying sixty five percent of the groceries? I don't pay for sixty five percent. Oh, you pay thirty five percent. Yeah. Why would you pay if you're paying the mortgage? Why would you pay any percent? Of she the pays groceries? half the mortgage. What? Yeah. So you charge her rent? <laughs> Fuck yeah! What a scumbag! You think you're living in my house for free? Wow. You are. You are something else. Yeah. You. <laughs> Daddy needs that money. I got to invest. S and P five hundred all the way, bro. Target and Bud Light. I heard InBev is your number one pick. Yeah. Not that we give out any picks. Yeah. But you're all about InBev and... I don't know what that is, but... You I don't know what InBev is? Is that InBreds? No. Not InBred. Bro. Owner of Bud Light, Anheuser Bush. His name is InBrev? No, the d- parent company is InBev. Is it really? Yes. I did not know that. Yes, you did, because you invest in it. Do they pay a good dividend? Not anymore. Yeah. Oh, 29% sales lost. Oof. Not that I would ever have drank a Bud Kid Rock. He will shoot down the competition. <laughs> what about Target? He will target the competition. He will t- you don't know about Target either? No, what did they do? You haven't heard about Target? Did they do gay stuff? Well, I mean, everybody does that. It's Gay Pride Month tomorrow. Yeah. What Today, are you doing to celebrate? Uh, taking in the butt. <laughs> okay. Let's... I'm going to Nashville. It's very uh, liberal, so I'm going to be Is liberal. Is it, though? With my I holes. guess it is. It is. Oh, oh my God! Yes, it's liberal. Really interesting. Yeah. Interesting. And well, country train run on me. Uh huh. <laughs> so uh, they had tuck. They had like children's tuck clothes. Oh Jesus! And then uh, I think a bunch of their stuff was literally designed by a Satanist. That sounds that's real something. smart. <laughs> I don't something. think I would hire a Satanist to do many things. I would not either. They sound very confused. Except maybe sacrifice things to the devil. but Well, they that. can't leave it in God's hands. They can only leave it in Satan's hands. That's and that doesn't flow off the tongue as good. Six in one hand, half dozen in the other. Six Satans in one hand, yep. four in the other. Six, six, six Satans. Uh-huh. So. So you learned something new today. I did. It's very exciting. But I think that. I think that's all we got for, for recapping he's, videos. He's very sad. He's very, he's very tired. When we do episode 500, down. we'll do a deeper dive. Maybe we'll bring Scott back for episode 500. Uh, you'll probably have had a heart attack by then. I hope so. And you'll be with your walker. Yeah. So Texas Ranger. Texas Ranger. They canceled that show, too. They did. 
the remake did you watch that no of course okay Not what me. okay i guess the last question i have for you is what are you going to do now that the cw is over find the tallest bridge in philadelphia and blow my brains out <laughs> just okay. and just drop it in the water uh-huh yeah there's there's i'm running out of shit to watch there is plenty to watch. You just I, gotta find it. I no, I refuse to put an effort for that. So I need to. So what? The CW is just easy. It is because uh-huh. it's superheroes. It's got some hot people in each show, typically. Uh huh. And uh, hot young teens. I do love a good teen. <laughs> uh-huh. That's legal in real life. Uh huh. Correction. Not like the kid in the dragon show. No. Well, I mean, he'll be legal eventually. Uh-huh. So I think it's that's just all like that. the Olsen twins. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That didn't work they're out not, so well. They're not very attractive. Neither no. is the other one. Who? The yeah. Elizabeth Olsen. She's attractive her. <laughs> On the scale of attractive, she's er. Yes, but not attractive. She's yeah. just er. She's something. Yeah, but... Uh, well, I guess that wraps... Wraps it up? 300. 300. We'll, we'll we did do, it. We'll have to do some sort of celebration We didn't have like a party. Short. We did not. We didn't have a cake. We'll have to do some You're sort of celebration. You're tired. Cel- yeah, I am. I, I got to drive 12 hours tomorrow. Again, that Fuck sounds off. like your problem. I will hopefully. That's I'm, a you problem. I'm be driving all day. This, this, as driving this is a airing, train. I'm probably going to be sleep deprived and one shot of, of, of free beverages at this expensive wedding is going to take me out. Expensive wedding? I think it's expensive. Yeah. In Tennessee. Nashville is Nashville. expensive as shit. You clearly... Yeah. Dude, a house in Nashville is more expensive than here. It is not. It is. It is not. Look it up, bro. It is not. Look it up, bro. Look it up. You have a thing. You I want to go to bed, so no, I will it. not look it up. So you're wrong as usual. No. Yes, you are. Get the futon out. I'm sleeping here. No. I have a nice lawn you can sleep on. That's fine. Okay. Can I get a blanket at least? No. Uh, pillow? You, you wear the mist. Fuck. <laughs> well, thank you. The biggest part of this 300 celebration is, me. is you. No, not him. You. Me. The, the people out there, the friends, the fam, the fans, you guys. You're what makes us keep going. We've crossed some amazing thresholds. We got to 300. We broke a thousand. We're at more than half a million views. So we appreciate everything that Still you not guys. Still a dollar of profit. Well, you get no profit, but remember indentured servitude. Yes. Yes. So we thank you for checking us out. We appreciate all of you out there. We'll have more giveaways, more fun. Back to our regularly scheduled programs i'd assume unless Maybe. he's gonna go we'll do see. other nonsense and um you know where to find us drop us a link leave some comments we love all y'all but we are on to 301 301 the next hundo